chose him for her own And her love made Clifford grow so big That the Howards had to leave their home Clifford's the best friend anyone could know He's the greatest dog ever I really think so Clifford's so loyal He's there when you call I love Clifford, the big red dog So they packed up a family car And the Howards left the city They moved to Birdwell Island and their many new friends There to greet Clifford and Emily Clifford's so much fun, he's a friend to us all I love Clifford, the big red dog Okay, T-Bone? <laughs> Would you like to come up here in my lap, pal? <laughs> well, come on up then. <laughs> Is this monster movie a little too scary for you, T-Bone? <laughs> okay then, we'll watch something else. Just remember, T-Bone, it was only a movie. There are no such things as monsters. <laughs> That's my good boy. There are no such things as monsters. There are no such things as things as monsters. Yo! Hi, T-Bone. What's going on? What were you saying about monsters? <sighs> there are no such things, Cleo. That's what I was saying. There are no such things as monsters. Who said there was? Nobody. It's just that I watched this monster movie last night, and I keep thinking about it. That's why I don't like to watch those kinds of movies. But I'm okay now, because I know there really are no such things as monsters. That's right. Okay, so let's forget about monsters and go to my house and play some ball. Okay! I'll go get the ball. So where's the ball, T-Bone? It's right here under the... What's the matter? Uh, nothing. It's just that there was a monster under the bed in the movie last night. Don't worry. I'll get it, T. <gasps> oh my gosh! Help! Cleo, what's wrong? Nothing. I was just fooling. Huh? Found it. <laughs> All right. There weren't any monsters under there, were there, Cleo? Nah, of course not. Let's go! Come on, big guy. Hit the ball! Okay, here it comes! I got it! 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 Uh-oh. You 
got it, T-Bone? Huh? Not yet! There's no such things as monsters. There are no such things as monsters. <gasps> There's no such things as monsters. There are no such things as monsters. Are you sure? Well, I, I'm pretty sure. It's kind of hard to see with your eyes closed. Want me to take a look? Sure! Found it! Thanks, Clifford. It, Jetta. I know I had my watch on when I left school yesterday before I went to your house. Maybe your watch band broke and it dropped at my house, Emily Elizabeth. Maybe. Let's go look. Here comes Clifford. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you too, Clifford. <laughs> Hi, Cleo. How are you, T-Bone? <laughs> Oh, hello, Mickey Wacky. <laughs> well, maybe the dogs can look around outside for your watch while we look around in the house. That's a great idea. Think you could sniff out my lost watch, Clifford? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we'll look in my bedroom. Okay. Let's help Emily Elizabeth look for her watch. Okay, if it's anywhere outside here, we'll find it. You bet! Yeah! Oh, sorry. I was just looking for Emily Elizabeth's watch. Have you seen it? Okay, thanks. to something, guys. Uh, yeah, I think I found it. I found something. I... Whoa! <laughs> Thanks, Cleo. I've been looking for that. You're welcome. Maybe Emily's watch is in here. No watch in here. I found it. I found the watch. Come on. Great. Mac found the watch. Mac found the watch. It's under there. Uh, uh, under the porch? Hmm, yeah. It's even too small for me under there. I'll bet I can fit. Are you okay, Cleo? What's wrong, Cleo? Oh, I got my bow stuck on something, and every time I try to move, it pulls my fur. Ow, 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 ow! Can you get unstuck? I don't think so. Oh, what should we do? I can't fit under there to help her, and neither can you, Clifford. There's no such things as monsters. There are no such things as monsters. I can! I'll go and help, Cleo. Are you sure, T-Bone? It's pretty dark under there. I know. The kind of place where monsters in the movies live. But 
there are no such things as monsters. Right? Right. You can do it. Go, T-Bone! There are no such things as monsters. There are no such things as monsters. Leo? Over here! Where's T-Bone? <gasps> wow! Here I am! You did it! Thanks, T! All right, T! He found Emily's watch, too! He sure did, right after he rescued me! Great job, T-Bone! Thanks! It was scary! But I knew I could do it. Arr! I'm afraid I'm never going to find my watch, Jetta. Emily Elizabeth, look! <gasps> my watch! T-Bone! <laughs> I'm sure glad we didn't have to crawl under and get it. It's creepy under there. Thank you, T-Bone. You're a very brave dog. Arr! Arr! the spectacular sandcastle. One sunny day, Speckle and his friends were at the beach doing what they liked to do best, building sandcastles. Each one of them had a favorite part of the castle that they liked to build. So Speckle suggested they work together to make the biggest sandcastle of them all. Luna went right to work on the tall towers. Speckle and Darnell built the sturdy outside wall. Viva dug the deepest moat she'd ever created. And Ravi found a piece of driftwood that was just perfect for the drawbridge. Finally, when they were all done, they had a castle so big and so strong, they could stand inside it. And everyone agreed it was the most spectacular sandcastle they'd ever made. The end. That was a great story. Isn't reading fun? <laughs> display in the library. Charlie and I are building a lighthouse this year, too. Oh, you are? A lighthouse? Emily, remember last year when our Statue of Liberty model won? I sure do. 
So does Clifford. <laughs> <laughs> maybe we'll win again this year. Yeah, maybe you will. See you later, Jetta. Bye, Jetta. Bye. Mac, if they build a lighthouse together, they'll probably win again. And I really want to win this year. Ugh. Look, Charlie, we can use these sticks to build our lighthouse. Really? I was thinking that maybe we'd use sugar cubes to build it. Well, maybe. Uh and then we can paint it really cool, like, like purple with orange circles. Woof. I don't know. A real lighthouse is usually white with red stripes. Aw, oh, come on, Emily. White is boring, but real lighthouses are purple. We can make ours look any way we want. <laughs> Emily, time to wash up for dinner. Okay, Mom. See you tomorrow, Charlie. And I still think we should paint it white with red stripes. And I still like purple with orange circles. <laughs> okay, Mackie, go fetch. Go on, go get it. Go find the stick. Are you looking for this, Jetta? Thanks, Charlie. So, did you and Emily Elizabeth start your project yet? Mm, sort of. Sort of? Well, Emily has lots of good ideas, but I like mine better. Oh, I like your ideas too. Maybe you should work alone this year. No, I don't think so. Or you could work with someone else this year, just for a change. Someone like me. Huh? That's a great idea! I'd love to work with you! Come over tomorrow morning and we'll get right to work. But uh, I, I told Emily that... Don't you worry. I'll talk to her. I'm sure she'll be much happier if she can do her own ideas. See you tomorrow! I'm gonna work with Jetta? Charlie sees how good this stick lighthouse looks. He's gonna love it! Oh no! Good morning, Emily Elizabeth. Hi, Jetta. Oh, too bad about your project. <laughs> That's okay, Jetta. Charlie will be here soon to help me fix it. Oh, but Charlie told me he isn't working with you anymore, Emily Elizabeth. Huh? Hmm? Yeah, I talked to him yesterday, and he said he thought his ideas were much better than yours. Charlie said that? Uh-huh. So, he's working with a new partner this year. He is? Uh-huh. So, I think maybe you should go ahead and work with someone else, too. Someone like... me. You? What's going on, Mac? I don't know. All I know is Jetta really wants to win the model contest this year. I'm kind of busy this morning, but you can come over after lunch today and we'll get right to work. See you later, Emily Elizabeth. I'm going to work with Jetta? Whoa, this is so perfect, Mac. Charlie and Emily Elizabeth always win. If I work with both of them, I'm sure to win too. Everything is going to turn out just perfectly. Hmm. How does this look, Jetta? <laughs> it's nice, but we should definitely use more glue. This looks pretty good, huh, Jetta? It's a little crooked, but that's okay. I'll fix that later. 
This color looks so cool. Why don't you grab a brush and help me, Jenna? That's okay. You finish the easy part, then I'll do the fancy stuff. Emily, Elizabeth, and I always did the painting together. Come and help me, Jetta. You paint the white, I'll paint the red. Charlie and I always did the painting together. I think Emily Elizabeth misses Charlie. I wish there was a way to get them back together. Clifford, time for dinner. Hey, that's Charlie's soccer ball. Wonder if he'll need it tomorrow. Maybe I should bring it to him. Woof, woof. You miss Charlie too, huh, boy? Woof, woof. Okay, then. We'll take his soccer ball to him first thing tomorrow. Woof. I hope Charlie's home this morning. Way to Jenna's house. Hey, look, it's Emily and Clifford. What? Hi, Clifford. Hi, Emily. Hi, Charlie. I was looking for you. Uh, Emily Elizabeth. What are you doing here? I want to give Charlie back his soccer ball. There you go, Charlie. Thanks, Emily Elizabeth. See you later. Woof. Woof. What's Clifford barking about? <laughs> Nothing. Woof. Woof. He wants you to see the lighthouse Jetta and I are making, Charlie. You're making a lighthouse with Jetta? Uh-huh. So am I. Woof. I don't get it, Emily. Why are you working with Jetta instead of me? Jetta told me you didn't like my ideas. Well, she told me you'd be happier doing things your own way. Jetta, what's going on? I really wanted to win this year, and I didn't think I could if you guys worked together, so I kept you apart. That wasn't very nice. We're friends, Jetta. You should have just told us how you felt. I know. It wasn't nice. I'm sorry. So, what do we do now? We have two lighthouses. Ruff. I have an idea. What is it? Well, maybe I could build a platform in the shape of the island, and, and we could put both lighthouses on it. You'll build the platform? Absolutely! Okay, then. Let's finish our project. Wow! First place! I can't believe it! I finally won! I? I? Oh, 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 just kidding. I mean, we won. Me and my two good friends. Hi, T-Bone. Can we play too? I'm not playing, Cleo. You're not? What are you doing, T-Bone? I'm cleaning my doghouse. Ooh, wouldn't you rather be playing with us? Well, yes. Then let's play. Nothing's more fun than playing with your friends, but it's a good idea to be responsible and finish your work before you start to play. Woof, woof. Come on, T-Bone, hit it back. Well, no. I made a promise to myself to finish cleaning my doghouse first. Then I'll play. Okay, T-Bone, can we help? No thanks. 
Are you sure? Uh-huh. This is my job. You guys keep playing. I'll be done in a minute. It feels good to finish a job you start. That's why Clifford's big idea for today is be responsible.